Regardless, if it's a bottle or can, I'm going to be reviewing a beer today, guys. Oh, PC Beer Reviews, PC Beer Reviews, PC Beer Reviews. Well, it's another episode of BC's Beer Reviews with your boy BC. Well, <laughs> if you can tell by the cup, you know kind of what I've got today. And, oh my lord, it's been a while since I've done one of these. <coughs> Seems like it's been forever. Now, anyways, today I have got Samuel Smith's Organic Chocolate Stout. That's right, that's what I got today. And man, it's been a long time. It's been a, it's been a minute since I've had a stout on the show. I miss these stouts. <coughs> and this one is a 5.0 APV with a 28 IBU. Which, I'm assuming it's going to be a bit better, somewhat. Um, now, they say this is, like, the oldest uh, brewery in Yorkshire, or Stone Yorkshire Squares, at the old brewery are used to ferment all Samuel products okay and they say the ideal temperature to drink this is 51 degrees um, I let it sit for at least a half hour or so so bottle fill you know, it's at least a uh, I want to say a half hour probably about 45 minutes to an hour because it feels kind of warm right now. <clears throat> a little bit warm now uh, this is a Pint bottle, according to the um, yeah, okay, it's one point or two point, or it's 550 milliliters. So now brewed with water from the original brewery well sunk in 1758. Uh, gently roasted organic chocolate malt and real organic cocoa used in this ale and part a delicious smooth and creamy character with inventing deep flavors and a delightful finish this is the perfect marriage of satisfying stout and luxurious chocolate this will lead to smiles and refills Samuel Smith's Brews its traditional coppers, uses stone Yorkshire squares for ferment, fermenting and ships every bottle from the brewery with great pride. <laughs> okay. Um, Flavored, um, okay. Uh, that's about, uh, that's about it. Product says malt beverage with natural flavors added. Samuel Smith Brewery. Yeah. Ted Casters and New York's. That's a product of the UK. Okay. Well. Uh, that's about the, all the jibber tip I can get on this bad boy. So, pop goes the top. Yeah. It was smelling good already. Getting some smoke on over here. Ooh, oh, oh, God, this is smelling so chocolatey right now. Ooh. Oh, yeah, this is looking so good. Well, I'm getting about three fingers worth the head on here. Khaki and color as far as the head goes. Uh, 
jet black, jet black. And generally when I look around the sides, there's generally a red U to it. But with this one, I'm not getting that. This is a solid black through and through. So, it looks nice. It looks nice. Spongy looking. Uh, yeah. Getting the chocolate in there for sure. The malt. There's something else to play here. Can't quite fit it down. It might be just the sweetness from the chocolate. It seems nice. Going by the smell. The look of it looks awesome. Yeah. Sm good it smells even better it actually does oh. I'm actually, it's actually nice it really is I can't get over this smell I really can't Well, okay, <laughs> let me move on. Enough of the jibber jibber, so to say. Let's get to tasting, shall we? Oh, 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 oh. oh my God. This is so nice. This is so nice. I was expecting some bitterness off of this from the malts, you know, but I'm not getting none of that. I'm not getting none of that. It's actually sweet. Yeah, chocolatey. Yep. I mean, you get the roasted malts in there, but it's not what you think. It's not like the burnt malts or roasted malts and some other drinks like this. It's really not, and this is a really good balanced beer here. It really is. I love this style. Wow. Yeah, it's a nice, perfect balance. You're getting the sweetness off the chocolate. You're getting the, cho the malts off of here. And you've got really nothing overpowering. The only thing that might be overpowering is the chocolate, or the sweetness of the chocolate. But that's not necessarily a bad thing. So, this one's actually, I would have to say, a most excellent style. I really do. I'm really enjoying this one. So, if I had to give this one a grade, <laughs> I already know what I'm going to give it, but let's just make sure. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to have to give this one a 10. This one is awesome. I'm, yeah. As one would say, this is a most excellent product. It really is. And the least thing on it is decent. I've had better on worse stouts on the least thing. But, I mean, you can't have it all. Or can you? <laughs> but this one, I'm actually really digging this is a 10. I'm going to join this one. And these guys produce other beers. They've got a strawberry one. And they've also got a lager one. That's also organic. So, if you guys want to check them out, by all means, check it out. another one down and like I've always said hey drink responsibly don't do another stupid peace out brother man peace out sister girl and I'll check you out next time here on the next PC's Bear Reviews.